Nahid, dearly honored guests and committee members, a gentle reminder that our event will be starting shortly. Please make yourselves comfortable to any of the available seats prepared. We would appreciate if you could put your mobile phones on silent mode throughout the function to enjoy the event. Ladies and gentlemen, in order to ease the flow of our joyous event, we would graciously like to remind ourselves to not restrict the viewing angles of our designated photographers and live video operators and to remain kindly seated during the certificate giving ceremony. We deeply appreciate your kind cooperation and understanding and regretfully apologize for the inconveniences caused. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In the name of Allah, the most merciful, the most compassionate. On behalf of Greenview Islamic International School Shah Alam, we would like to extend a very good morning to our guests in the hall, all our viewers who are watching this live stream online, teachers, staff, and students. Welcome to the Greenview Islamic International School Graduation Ceremony 2020-2021. Ladies and gentlemen, as we are sure you are already aware, the Omicron virus outbreak has led to a need for social distancing to help prevent the spread. Kindly ensure that all of us follow the SOP guidelines throughout the entire event. We hope you understand that this is a necessary step to help keep each other safe in this unprecedented time. We would like to welcome our honored guest, Mr. Muhammad Azman Tansri Hamza the school director, Mrs. Azman, group principal of Greenview Islamic International Schools, Mr. Rahim, principal of Greenview Islamic International School, Shah Alam, Dr. Hussein Abdi, principal of Greenview Islamic International School, Bangi, Mr. Kasmir, our vice principal, of Greenview Islamic International Schools. Ladies and gentlemen, dedicated teachers and staff of Greenview Islamic International School and beloved graduates, to extend a cheerful welcome to all of you to the graduation ceremony of Greenview Islamic International School 2020-2021. I am Mrs. Fatin. Dear parents, as is customary, Greenview Islamic International School graduation ceremony begins with the Lua by Ahmed Samir Azmi from year 11. A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajeem Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Hamdan Hamidin Hamdan Shakirin Hamdan Yuwaf Bin Yaman Waika Afilu Mazida Ya Rabbana Lakal Hamduka Ma Yam Maghli Li Jalali Wajika Al Karim Wa Azimi Sultanik Allahumma Fa'alayna Hikmataka Wa Ansur Alayna Min Qazain Al Rahmatik Ya Arham Al Rahimin Allahumma Bihaqli Hazi Al Fatiha Il Tahrana Wa Bihazi Shafi'a Ishbina La Ilaha Illa Anta Subhanaka Inni Kuntu Minas Zalimin لا إله إلا أنت سبحانك إني كنت من الظالمين لا إله إلا أنت سبحانك إني كنت من الظالمين يا الله يا أرحم الراحمين هي بس تكفس إيمان 
good health and a long life. Ya Allah, give our parents, our teachers, and our descendants steadfast iman, good health, and a long life. Ya Allah, invite us all into your Jannah. Ya Allah, guide us always so that we are always on the straight path, Sirat al Mustaqim. Ya Allah, grant us knowledge so that we may be of the Ulul al mentioned in the Quran you have sent to us. Ya Allah, grant us the risk to speak well in Arabic, Bahas, Malaysia, and English. Ya Allah, make us eloquent of speech, make us understand everything that we read, see, hear, understand, and learn. Ya Allah, ensure that we are always kind in our words and actions towards our parents, our teachers, our friends, and all of mankind. Ya Allah, give your blessings and your peace on Nabi Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, his family and his companions. Allahumma sirri Islam wa al Muslimin fi Palestine wa fi Iraq wa fi Syria wa fi Libya wa fi Afghanistan wa fi Malaysia wa fi Burma wa fi kulli makan. Allahumma inna na'uzubik min qalbin la yaksha wa min du'ain la yusma wa min nafsin la tashba wa min ilmin la yakfa. La ilaha illallah wa hadahu la sharika lah. Lahul mulku wa lahul hamdi yuhi wa yimitu biyadika khayr wa hu ala kulli shayin qadir. اللهم لا سهلا إلا ما جلته سهلا وعددل الحزن والصعوبة إن شئت سهلا ربنا آسنا في الدنيا حسنا وفي الآخرة حسنا وقنا عذاب النار وقنا عذاب الكبر وقنا عذاب المحشر وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين سبحان ربي رب العزة أما يسيبون والسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين we would now invite a Hafizul Qur'an Muhammad from 5R for the recitation of Surah Fatir Ayah 27 to 30, followed by the translation by Ahmed Samir Azmi. ألم تر أن الله أنزل من السماء ماء فأخرجنا فأخرجنا به ثمرات مختلفا ألوانها ومن الجبال جدد بيد وحمر مختلف ألوانها وقراب See you not that Allah sends down water from the sky, and we produce therewith fruits of varying colors. And among the mountains are streaks white and red of varying colors, and others very black. <laughs> And of men and at the world, who being living creatures, beasts, etc., and cattle in like manner of various colors, it is only those who have knowledge among his slaves that fear Allah. Verily, Allah is Almighty of forgiving. إن الذين يتلون كتاب الله وأقاموا الصلاة وأنفقوا مما رزقناهم سرا وعلانية يرجون تجارة لن تبور ليوفيهم أجورهم ويزيدهم Verily, those who recite the book of Allah, this Quran, and perform a salah, and spend in charity out of what we have provided for them, secretly and openly, hope for a sure breaking that will never breach, that He may pay them their wages in full and give them even more out of His grace. Verily, He is of forgiving most ready to appreciate good deeds and to recompense. Sadaqallahu al-Azim. 
Thank you, Muhammad and Azmi. Ladies and gentlemen, with love in our hearts, let us all rise for the national anthem followed by the Salamo State Song. Ahmed Samir asked me to perform the school pledge and the shahada. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands on your desk. We are going to do the shahada and the school pledge. 
Asyadu an la ilaha illallah Wa asyadu anna muhammadan rasulullah I bear witness That there is no God but Allah And I bear witness That Muhammad is the messenger of Allah We Students of Greek Islamic International School Pledge ourselves to be thinking and caring global citizens, standing firm on justice and equality, so as to build a peaceful, progressive, and prosperous Ummah under one God. Thank you. Thank you, students. Ladies and gentlemen, the theme for today's event is Then and Now. As we reflect on this journey called life, we understand that in these moments, it has been a challenging journey for all of us. Hence, we celebrate our perseverance and growth by sharing our joyous memories in this prestigious event that we may continue to rise up to make a better and wondrous future for all of us. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to invite our school director, Mr. Muhammad Azman Tansri Hamza, to come on stage to officiate our event today as well as deliver the opening speech. Please welcome. Despite the limitations of the MCO lockdown, they have overall done very well in the IGCSE examinations. Well done. I would like to take this opportunity to thank the parents for their support that they have given to the school, without which review won't be here today. And we ask the parents to continue to go up for review that we can continue to provide quality education for the Quran. Inshallah. Thank you. Wa bilahi tawfiq wa hidayah. Wa salam. Wa Thank you, Mr. Azman. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now my honor to invite our beloved school principal, Mr. Rahim, to deliver his welcoming speech. Please welcome. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillah ar-Rabbil alamin. Wassalatu wassalamu ala ashraf al-anbiya al-mursaleen wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in amma ba'an Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh and very good morning to all those who are present here today Mr. Muhammad Azman bin Tansri Hamza the director of the Greek Islamic International School Mrs. Azman, the group principal Dr. Sayyid Hussein Abdin, the principal of the Bani School. Dear teachers, the staff of the school, dear parents, invited guests, graduates, and students. 
I cordially invite all of you to this graduation ceremony for the batch of 2020-2021. Uh, first and foremost, I would like to express my gratitude to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for enabling us to conduct this ceremony. Dear graduates, I am very pleased, apart from being your principal, I was also privileged to be your teacher. And this pivotal movement in your life, I would like to share the following advice with you. Number one, stay humble throughout your whole life. We are the servants of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the basic duty of the servant is submission. And submission requires obedience, humility. You know, life, don't be distracted by authority, wealth, position, titles, status, privileges that you have accumulated. Indeed, these are both blessings, ni'mah, and test from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Do good with what you have, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala keep on giving you more and more. Number two, inculcate gratitude, shukur. Dear students, no one accomplishes anything in life by themselves. All your achievements were facilitated by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. There are your loving and supportive parents their financial sacrifice, your helpful teachers, your siblings, and your friends who have contributed to making you the person you are today. You wouldn't be where you are today without their help. Attribute all your success to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and give due credit to those who are around you. Number three. Second last. Be resilient like a palm, dead palm tree. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam likened a believer to a dead palm tree. Remember, you, have, you will face a lot of challenges, hardships, as well as ups and downs in your life. They're, they are there to help you to build your willpower and resilience. Make sure you bounce back like a dead palm tree. Lastly, have the right perception about success in your life. Dear students, we must reassess and recalibrate our definition of success in life. Don't mistake worldly successes for Allah being pleased with you. Because remember, there were many so called successful people who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala was displeased with. The true success, Al Falah, consists of consistent commitment in submission to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the success in the hereafter. When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala invites all his servants, inshallah, including us into his paradise. Jannah. Dear students, we are very proud of you all, 2020-2021 cohorts. Your results speak for themselves. It is indeed a great achievement, as Mr. Azman mentioned just now, especially against the backdrop of the pandemic which was a great challenge and really quite frustrating for you, so to speak. This proves how far your hard work, your determination, your resilience can take you in your life. Be proud alumni and the ambassador of GBIIS. Remember us in your future successes. 
Congratulations on all on your graduation and wish you all the best as you begin your next chapter in your life. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you, bless your families, <coughs> keep us safe and healthy. Amin, Amin, Ya Rabbul Alameen, Jazakumullahu Khairan Kathiran, Wassalamu Alaikum Wa Rahmatullahi Wa Barakatuh. Thank you, Mr. Rahim. Ladies and gentlemen, before we proceed, it would be our pleasure to indulge you a short video presentation prepared as our Greenview Islamic International School Past Memories. Let us all sit back and enjoy the presentation. We hope the video presentation has brought back memories for you. We assure all parents who are viewing, wherever you are, are proud to see their students during those treasured moments and fond memories. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with appreciation that we would like to invite student representative Ms. Hana Khadija Binti Shamim Nori to deliver her speech. Please welcome Hana Khadija. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning to the school director, principal, teachers, family, and my fellow graduates. I feel honored to be back at this alma mater. Greenview has taught me so much, and I believe this is also the same for all of you, the graduating class of 2021. Congratulations to all. No one but my family, or maybe just my sister alone, knew what kind of a student I was. I was actually promoted from year 9 to year 10 during the second term, and I had a lot to catch up on. I asked my sister to teach me at math, physics, and chemistry, and you all, I bet she regretted helping me. She stayed up late at night to teach me, but I always ended up sleeping before I even studied anything. Either way, I'm grateful that she helped me because she motivated me to strive harder. But most importantly, to my graduate teachers who have truly made the transition easier. To my friends, thank you for all the great memories we shared together. I miss those days we laughed until our stomach hurt. I miss all our deep and funny conversations. Thank you for the company. 
and I hope our friendship will be as strong in the years to come. And again, to all my teachers, thank you for believing in me and guiding me throughout my studies. There's no word to fully express my gratitude to you, and I believe I speak on behalf of everyone in saying thank you. Our final year at Urmu was anything but normal in the very sense of the word. The pandemic has changed every single aspect of our lives, and this included the way we went to school, learning, interacting, and even sitting for our exams. But still, we managed to break through all of these challenges despite all the uncertainty. And today, here we are at our graduation. Thank you to the teachers, faculty members, staff, and most importantly, the people that makes review what it is, the students. Last but not least, I would like to end with a Malay Pantun. Kalau ada semua di ladang, boleh saya numpang mandi. Kalau ada umur yang panjang, boleh kita berjumpa lagi. If there is a red bean in your field, with you I will store my dream. If length of years the face but you, in future we too shall meet again. Thank you. Thank you, Hannah. Ladies and gentlemen, now we would like to invite another precious representative of our graduates Mr. Muhammad Imran bin Haris Fazila to deliver his speech. Please welcome. share some of my memories with all of you. First off, 15th of February, the year 2020, also known as Sports Day. One of the biggest Sports Day events in Greenview history. Why was it so grand, you may ask? Both Sha'alam and Bangi branches finally collaborated in this mashup of an event. And together, we even competed with other schools like Apis, the Jefferson National School. The atmosphere in the stadium that day was unreal. There were people doing Walmart from a distance. The aroma of Milo coming from the Milo truck and the music that was playing from the stadium speaker. All of these things, although small, it painted us an image and reminded us of what that day felt like. You know, there's this unique anxiety that one gets when it comes to participating in sports day events. Uh, I'm no athlete, my parents can agree on that. But I know some students here can probably explain that feeling of anxiousness better than I can. Uh, if you want to know the winning house that won that year, it was the Red House, yeah. which, is, which is unsurprising actually, because there were so many athletic people in Red House, all the other houses kind of looked like kindergarten children. No offense. <laughs> in fact, I am the captain of the Yellow House, so you can understand how sad I felt when I lost. But it was still a very fun and enjoyable experience. It's unfortunate that this event was our last sports day because roughly a month after uh, our quarantine had started. Despite that, I am glad we ended it with a bang because to me, that event represented the unification of everyone in Greenview. Everyone played their part and participated as much as they can. We were a global village, like my teacher would say. Moving on, you know, the truth regarding schools is that it's not always going to be rainbows and sunshine. Uh, for instance, a student can fail in their chemistry test one day and win a football game in the next, or vice versa. 
The point I would like to convey is that living our lives is as much of joy as it is going to be of sadness. You can't have one without giving the other. They're like two sides of the same coin. Some of you on the crowd may want to relive your past happy moments, your beloved memories, and honestly, I don't blame you. But what nobody wants to relive are the depressive, heart-wrenching moments of our lives, the times when we felt like we're all alone and lost, with no one there to ask us if we're okay or if we're fine. But don't be afraid. Don't be afraid of those moments and the ones that are yet to come. Talk about it with friends. Laugh about it. Take time to embrace who you once were and become better. It may not be today, it may not be tomorrow, or even the day after that. But know one thing, that life will change. Before I go, I want to end with a quote from a Japanese proverb. Fall seven times, stand up eight. And no, I did not steal that from someone's Facebook page. I would like to, I would like to thank the schools for giving me this chance to speak. I would like to thank the teachers for all their hard work throughout these years. I would like to thank my parents for supporting me through my hardships and uh, up, uh, ups and downs. And also, I would like to thank my friends for being with me and making this rather stressful experience one of a lifetime, one of a lifetime of experience. And also, I would like to thank all of you for listening to me. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you, Imran. Um, I would like to request for another round of applause for Hannah and Imran in Spartan's <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it would be our utmost appreciation to invite our beloved Mr. Azman to be on stage to present the graduation certificate to our following students. In order to ease the flow of our joyous event, we would graciously like to remind ourselves do not restrict the viewing angles of our designated photographers and live video operators and to remain kindly seated during the certificate giving ceremony. Graduates, please come forward as your names are being called out. Aris Ahmad bin Adlan. Thank you, Mr. Azman. We 
We would now like to invite our beloved Mrs. Asman to be on stage to present the graduation certificates to our following students. Graduates, please come forward as your names are being called out. Azim Azari Bin Azahar. Dania Humaira Bin Ihafis Iskandar. Graduates, please come forward as your names are being called out. Ibrahim Ibnu Mahbo. the graduation certificates to our following students. Graduates, please come forward as your names are being called out. Muhammad Eden bin Abdul Munir.
Sina Mirza binti Hakumir Ali. Christina Nur Alia Maria Binti Ali. Thank you, Dr. Said Hussein. We would like to invite our beloved Mr. Kasmir Singh to be on stage to present the graduation certificate. Graduates, please come forward as your names are being called out. Rain Alkin Bin Amirnova. Riyad Ali Bin Kaslan. Said Muaz bin Said Razi. Yasmin Anissa Binti Amir Faisal. Alexander Zulkarnay Bin Suhaili. and our heartiest congratulations again to our wonderful students of the graduation. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we now invite Dr. Hussein, our principal of Greenview Islamic International School, Bangi, to deliver his closing speech. Please welcome. Thank you, Mrs. Fatih. Alhamdulillah, illahi ni'mat bi ni'matihi tatimu salihat. Salatu wa salamu ala ashraf al-makhluqat. Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in amma ba'd. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. To Mr. Muhammad Azman Tanzi Hamza, the director of the New Islamic International School and Mrs. Azman, the group principal. Then Mr. Muhammad Rahim, Muhammad Ibrahim Rahim, the principal of the Islamic International School, Shalam. Mr. Kasmir Singh, the vice principal of the Islamic International Schools, schools. Mr. Abdul Salam, the information service manager. The amazing Greenview teachers. The graduates, my dearly wife, my sister, dear parents, and my fellow colleagues and friends. It is an honor to be given an opportunity for delivering the closing remark today, where my elder son also made it possible with his friends and classmates. Dear students, you all have made it guys. And you have graduated from your high school education, alhamdulillah. Let's start off by giving a huge, well-deserved round of applause to our dream new graduates.
Sunday, 2020-2021 will call. Renew has opened the gate for you all to further your study. You are our brand ambassadors. We wish you all success in your life. Dear participants, now I am going to read out some part of the speech delivered by one of our graduates from Bunny Branch last week. Although I had only went to Greenview for barely a year, the Greenview has made such huge impact on my life. I would learn to live through ups and downs and learn to face different challenges in my time here. And it wouldn't have been possible without a, without the people, those who are in this hall. Yes, it is 100% true that the dedication and commitment of our teachers can be seen from our graduate space. They are and here to those who are present. Dear parents, every child can make it possible in Greenview. Greenview is amazing because of our amazing teachers and staff. Alhamdulillah. Let us give another well deserved round of applause to our Greenview teachers and staff and our wonderful parents. Thank you, teachers, staff, and parents. And thank you, Mr. and Mrs. Smart. Thank you, everyone who have made this event a successful and memorable one. Let us raise our hands to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the bright future of our future leaders. And for all of us, Al-Fatiha. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, Ar-Rahman, Ar-Rahim, Al-Manik, Yawm Al-Din, Iyak Al-Abud, Wa Iyak Al-Nasta'in, Dina Sirat Al-Mustaqim, Sirat Al-Ladina Na'amta Alayhim, Wa Iri Al-Maqdubi Alayhim, Wa Al-Dallin, Ameen. Bismillah, Al-Ladhi La Yabdur Ma'as Bihi Shayu Fi Al-Ardi, Wa La Fi Al-Samaa, Wa Huwa Al-Samin Al-Alim, اللهم اغفر لنا ذنوبنا وخطايانا كلها يا رب العالمين اللهم إنا نعوذ بك من البعس والجنون والجذام ومن سيء الأسقام اللهم اجعلنا من النبيين والصديقين والشهداء والصالحين ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وفي العذاب النار صلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين والحمد لله يا رب العالمين آمين آمين يا رب العالمين Thank you for blessing me. Thank you for blessing me. Ladies and gentlemen, we would now like to invite our esteemed graduates to the stage for a memorable photography session.